think about freedom of information, we generally mean as journalists our ability to access government documents. That's important because the government is a representative of Canadians and the information that they have uh, belongs to Canadians. So journalists typically are trying to find out what's really going on behind closed doors and in institutions when Canadians have complained. Access to information is critical. Without that access, there's no way to judge your government. There's no way to know whether people are being treated fairly. There's no way to know what's being done in your name as a citizen and with your money. How does the access to information system affect my job as a journalist? Well, it should be a critical tool. It should be the cornerstone of uh, finding out what's going on in government or in government agencies. Uh, unfortunately, uh, it often takes a very long time uh, to get any kind of a response to applications. And when you do get the response, it can be very limited. A lot of the information can be blacked out or deleted. Uh, unfortunately, as a result of that, uh, more and more journalists are making fewer and fewer access to information applications. Uh, and that, of course, makes it difficult to do our jobs as journalists. It makes it difficult for us to communicate information to, to citizens. And it makes it easier for the government to go unscrutinized. The current state of access to information is, is very poor. And the result is that journalists have to find many other ways to get information from the government. If you're a young journalist and you're filing your first access to information request, uh, do it before you do anything else on your story. Because the thing we know is that the government takes a really long time to respond. So do it first and remember that unfortunately, while it should be one of your most important tools, in Canada in 2011, it is not going to be the effective piece of investigation we need it to be. So file your application and then hit the street and find some other way to get the information that you need to tell the story accurately. It's likely uh, if fewer journalists are using access to information applications, it's because they're ineffective and uh, they're not helpful. People don't have the time or the money to waste. They need their story. They need the facts. They're going to find those facts in the most expedient way possible. Uh, we do know that, that courts, not just here but around the world, are urging more freedom of expression protections and more access to information. We can only hope that uh, our current government listens to that.